In New York City, ICE says it has arrested more than 40 people over the last week. The raids in the city alone come despite the fact that Mayor Bill de Blasio has insisted New York City is a sanctuary city. On Saturday, hundreds protested the New York Police Department's broken windows policing strategy, under which the police target and arrest people for low-level offenses, funneling people into a process that can result in deportation. Under President Trump's public safety executive order, immigrants face deportation if charged with a crime, even if they're never convicted. This is Albert St. Jean, a Haitian-American fellow with the Black Alliance for Just Immigration, addressing Mayor de Blasio at the protest Saturday. He has to get his house in order if he really wants a, a, a sanctuary city, a, a freedom city. You know where we can where we can feel free to walk around in our own communities without feeling like you know I did something wrong just for existing. Where 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 we don't have to make like where little mistakes won't ruin the rest of our lives. At a march after the protest, police arrested five protesters, charging four with crossing against a steady red light and one with resisting arrest and obstructing governmental administration. One of 170 offenses the New York Police Department cooperates with federal immigration authorities on. We'll have more on the immigration raids nationwide later in the broadcast.